Welcome back to Thief, folks. So here we are. Another hammerite coming around the corner. That is convenient. So we can pile them up in the cell number five. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone else. Oh, could you shut up, please? So many noises. Crazy laughter. <laughs> yeah, everyone is lazy, incompetent. So this is the second level. And he turns around so we... Wow. That was damn close. <laughs> you don't like rats, don't you? Come on, turn around. Yeah, thanks. Someone in there? No. Thank God not. So if you get close to a prison or a prison cell and there's someone inside that is not familiar with you or that you don't know, um, they start to complain and riot and stuff like that. That's very unfortunate. Um, okay, let's see how can we open it. Here we go. Let's just wait. And we knock him down. Or we can just leave him here. And the door locks automatically again. So, here we go. These are the different handles. One handle for every cell down there in block number one. But unfortunately there are no numbers to indicate which handle works for which cell. But as you can tell, you have, I guess, six cells downstairs, while there are four upstairs. And that means these on the side, this one on the side, are the ones for the upstairs cells. At least I think so. Yeah. I guess this opened. Cell next to us. Yeah, correct. Cell number 10 then. And in the other one there was a skeleton. Right in here. And look at this. I guess this is Isa, the beggar. Oh, how is he called? Is it the beggar? And his hand of glory. Yes. So we got that objective ticked off. So the beggar died in the cell. A long time ago, it seems. And nobody freed him. Or just dragged his body away. Alright, so we need more valuables. We got nothing for the lucky end of glory. It's not out of gold or something. Um, and we have to release Cutty and Basso still. However, I guess none of them is in the south block number one. At least not downstairs. And who's in there? Uh, it's just a peasant. Or a servant, don't know. Well, we could have a look um, at the list of imprisoned persons still. No, just... Okay, support number one. Rendell, Dallin, Senate, and Isid. Died neath righteous punishment. Okay, so he got punished. For just being in the cell, or I don't know. So there's none of them <laughs> is of any interest. We we'll just leave this place and go visit subblock number two. What was that? Hey, come on, shut up. <laughs> They're going crazy. So subblock number two should be next door. We go through here. Hopefully, there's no guard around to just hide in here. Do a quick save. Alright. There's the guard. And yeah, there's a stair leading down to the torture room. 
Okay, let's move. Oh, let's wait again. Stand forth <laughs> and speak thyself if thou be there. It seems nothing now. Okay. Okay, this is going to be tricky. Let's be careful. Come on, turn around. Thank you. Anyone inside? Nope. Again, no one. Got you. So, who is in those cells? We have Apostle Vandal, Gallant, Namon. Uh, it's just useless. No one inside we could ask something or we should free. And usually there are no valuables in any cells. Why would there be? They're just taken away from the prisoners. Level 1, so do we go downstairs? Let's take the stairs here. Let's have a look into this torture room then. Here we go. Nothing too fancy, but quite cool. And this is the connection between the different cell blocks as well. So we can visit cell block number three now. But first, first we wait here. I see nothing now. In case any hammerites sneak by, yeah. That's the first one. Ooh, that was... That was damned close. We better hide him somewhere else. Let's just leave him here and... Let's hide him up here. Guess no one will ever find him. The guards won't wake up anyway, so they will be knocked out for the whole entire level. Or map. Okay, cell block number three. So we've done the first and second one. Alright, here we go. Come on, turn around. Thank you. Can't see anyone. Who's that? Oh. Poor fellow died a while ago. Oh, who's coughing? Could that be Basso? I don't know. We, we'll have a look into onto the list and find out. Oh, that's a nice present. What's inside here? Just a bright room without nothing. Very clever. Oops. <laughs> Hello, sir. Or is it a ma'am? Something moved, thought I saw. All is quiet now. Yeah. There's someone in here. That's dangerous. Okay. They don't mind opening doors. What's that? 
There's a guy over here. Help me. <laughs> yeah, see? They will alert everyone nearby. Okay, who do we have? Basso. The boxman. In cell number four. I see. Heretic. Goldlander. No scrubbed. So we could open number four then. But um, we will do that later. Since Basil we have to we have to guide him outside. And that is quite risky. Ever though we just wait and kill or knock out all the other guards before we do that. But I know he's in cell block three. Hurry, cell number four. Save me. That's alright. Okay, last one. Block number four. This is where Cutty is supposed to be then. It is the builder's piece now. <coughs> no, let's be no. All right. <coughs> All right, Cutty. There we have them. Soul number six. <laughs> so, it's that one on the left. Yep, it's opened. Anyone else of any interest? No. Wills, Miser, Possum. Okay, let's visit Cuddy then. Yeah, you might wonder why I free him right away. But since I played this game quite a lot, I know what's going to happen to him. But you will find out in a second. Okay, no guards patrolling? No. Alright, old man. Let's get you out of here and me and my money. <laughs> Afraid you're gonna be disappointed? Good thing you're dying, Cuddy. Or I'd have to kill you for stiffing me. Again. Snap, snap, puppy. <coughs> but I owe you, so... <coughs> Felix went after the horn of Quintus, down the bone hoard. Left me his notes. The hammers got him. Put him in there. Evidence box. Loot collection, more like. Upstairs. Officer's quarters. Once you're up there, in passage, if damp hadn't rotted my lungs. <coughs> oh, Cuddy. And there he goes. That's why you can free him right away. Oh, shut up. So, to the officer quarters. We go. And we find to... We ought to find these plans he was talking about. It's about stealing a horn from the bone hoard. Um, since he can't give us money for the scepter anymore, he gives us another job before he dies. So, question is how to get to the officer levels now. It's in subplot number one that we have the way to it. So, we have to go back then. And see what awaits us there. Well, we will do that next time. See you guys.